Right, welcome back to Spitting the Dripper Reviews, and today we're doing an e-juice review on a company called Bait. Now these are under the wing of Juice Sauce, you can add them up at www.juicesauce.co.uk, they're on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. A big shout goes out to James Campbell, who's the wholesale manager. Um, now these are VGPGs of 80VG, 20PG, nicotine strengths of zero. They come as a 100ml bottle with 90ml of zero nic e liquid with the room for a 10ml headshot, which makes it a 2mg in strength. And the three flavours that we're doing are toasted, dunked, and lemon trip. Now what we'll do is we'll go back through the flavour profiles as we vape up on these and we'll talk more about what's inside them and whether they do what they say on the tin flavour wise. Um, also we're going to be showing you the packaging, the logos and all the goodness like that and also we're going to be checking out the cloud. So don't go nowhere and catch us back in a minute. Right, welcome back to Spitting the Dripper Reviews and like we said on the desktop we're doing this company out in front of us and these are under the wing of juice sauce and this company is called Baked. Um, now basically, where's the box gone for that one? Just before we... Uh Right, so basically the three flavours that we're going to be doing are called Toasted, Dunked and Lemon Trip. Um, these are the boxes and how they come, if you want to have a little look at that. Nice bit of packaging. I like the little shop he's got going on yeah. there as well. These are the bottles. Now these come as 90ml, well 100ml, but 90ml zero nick e-liquid um, with a room for a, a 10ml 20mg nick shot which makes it into a 2mg in strength. Um, so basically the first flavour we're starting off is called toasted um, and is it toasted? Yeah, yeah. it's toasted and the flavour uh, the flavour profile if you want to read that. It's a deliciously sweet French toast. So. And as we was discussing... Um, you still didn't answer me French though, toast. did you? Yeah, what's the difference toast. between toast and French toast? Toast is toast, French toast is toast, then cut in half and toasted again. Alright. There is it? Done. Yeah. Oh, right. I thought it was just toast made oh. in France. No. <laughs> Let me have a smell of the juice while you have a vapour. Well, it don't smell like toast, but it smells like a creamy niceness going on. People have it a lot. That's oh, that smells like amazing. That. Smell that. That really does smell nice. I like the little bakery shop they've got going on on the, on the logos as well, as you can see there, little bakery shop. Obviously, because the range is called baked. But um, yeah, let's have a rundown. What you're getting, sugar lip, all that sort of goodness. Getting a nice sugar lip to it. Not so much toast, but you're getting this creaminess. That's what I could smell. Mm. That's strange. Like a more of a cakey than a yeah, toast. That's what it smells like. Which is like. fine by me. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> Maybe he's got a run and French toast. Is a cake. No. <laughs> <laughs> You know I'm right. <laughs> oh, there we go. See us again now. Yeah, you're right though. You're what getting like I was a, expecting. No, like, like a caramelly sort of cakey going on. It's like a Virgin confetti cake. Yeah, yeah, it's really not. And the sugar lips, lovely. Yeah, isn't it? What a great bit of sugar lip. That's oh. a nice one, that is. But I'm getting like a, a like at the start, you're getting like a sugar boosted cake. And then mid-drift you get a bit of a, like almost like a syrupy caramel going mm. on. And it's really nice. I like it. You like it? Yeah, it ain't what you think it's going to no. be, is it? No. I like it. I think it's nice. Good one to start with that. It is like a cake. Yeah. Mm. I'm definitely right though. <laughs> Google it afterwards. Yeah, isn't it? Mm. <laughs> I might have a little another go, eh? Yeah, go on. The sugar lips really nice to be fair. I do like the like I said, the way it comes in with a, a beautiful sugary cake. Um which, which is obviously really not in the description crazy, as far as I know. I mean I don't know what French toast is, but to me this is how I get it. I get a lovely sugary cake coming in and then mid drift I get this like caramelly syrupy going on and it's it's really nice to mm. be fair. I like it. It wasn't what really I was expecting, in but in an such Excel. a good way. Mm. That's virgin a confetti cake. Yeah. And that's nice. Yeah, definitely. Right. right, moving on to the next one. Next one's called Dunked, and this is a cream filled sponge dunked and fried in golden syrup. Mm. Sounds nice. No. Now this one to me, again, it's got that 
Yeah, what is actually in it? A cream-filled sponge dunked yeah, and fried that, in me, golden syrup. That to me is what I'm. I'm not getting the the syrup or the the friedness to it, but I'm getting um like a what's it called that the, the cake you used to have with the cream and the strawberry jam sort of thing in it. You know the sponge cake. What was it Victoria called? Sponge. Victoria sponge. That's to me exactly what I'm getting. Is a beautiful Victoria sponge vape to it. Oh. oh, I like that. Yeah, you got an orb there from Bad Cop. Yeah, yeah, it's got that Victoria sponge feel to really me. Really nice, like even like you know, like sponge. the powdery dust in your sugar mm. they put on the top. That I can even taste right at the end now. I'm left with like lashings of sugar. It's really nice, but it's not overly done where it's off putting. It's you know, I would say around 55 mark for you the, the sugar percentage of sugar. Away, do you? No, it's right at the end. Yeah, like a powdered sugar. Sugar, mm. it's really nice. Well, oh, it is nice. Mm. Let's see what he thinks. I don't normally care what I think. <laughs> <laughs> and again, I can just smell like a. I mean, you can smell a bit of syrup in the in the vape, like, but it's more about the cake. But you can't taste it in the vape to me. It's just more like a Victoria sponge. I was expecting it to be oily from the description with it being fried, but there's, no. No, there's nothing to that. And it is more like a, a Victoria sponge than Definitely anything else. Definitely scent to me. And getting that sugar lip, that's mm. lovely. But as you said, not straight away. Mm. Then it comes in. Definitely. Yeah, I'd, I'd say that's more like a Victoria sponge. I like it, I think it's nice. Mm. Right, sadly moving on to the last one, because I've really enjoyed these first two so far. Um, and this one's one. called Lemon Trip. This is a zesty lemon curd atop a crumbly biscuit base. It's mm. up your street, this, isn't it? Yeah. Does it smell like it? You can smell the lemon, but you can't smell no biscuit in it. Oh, that old chestnut. <laughs> no chestnut. <laughs> It's nice, it's an odd lemon though. That's that's more It's meant to be a lemon it. curd. It is yeah. it's more like that. Mm. A zesty lemon curd. It almost wobbles on the crumbly biscuit base. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, like yeah. that. You getting any biscuit in there? Slightly. Not as much as I'd want. It's more like a like I don't know, it's like bordering like a sweetie sort of lemon, you know, like a boiled sweet sort of lemon. Oh, right, yeah. And I mean, the smelling the bottle, you can't well. smell any biscuit. And the smell of the lemon's kind of weird from the yeah. bottle as well. It's not it like, is, you know, normally you smell like they've used, I'd say, it's just only my opinion, that they've used two lemons in it. Right. To try and get more thing in. They're just, they're not, he's just, look at him, look. he loves it. I'm so the toast. Um, I have to agree with you, it's got a, a bold, sweetie lemon feel to it. Um, I am getting that sort of midriff pastry stroke biscuit -y sort of feel to it's it. It's only quick though, isn't it? Yeah, it is, it is quick. It's, it is a crumbly biscuit, but it comes in and it goes quite quick. Um, but the lemons are, I don't know, like you said, if there's two lemons used, it could be a clash going on. Yeah. But if not, then, you know, to me, it's like a, almost like a, you know them ye yellow lemon sherbets? Yeah. It's got a bit of a feel to that with biscuit yeah. mm. to me. That's what it feels it's like. It's lacking in biscuit and the biscuit base for me. But yeah, the lemon, mm. you start off you getting that curd, like you know, what you would put on the old toast and that, but then yeah. it just goes something different. Yeah, almost like, like sherbet. Yeah. Really, yeah. But um, yeah, I mean, it's still not a bad vape. I'll, I'll, you know, I'd vape it, but uh, to be fair, the first two to me yeah, were, were much better to me. Mm. But um, If you had to pick one. Middle one. Yeah, me and I. First one. <laughs> I'm so used to having a serious fight after all this, though, isn't it? I'm doing all right. Well, don't forget to subscribe to us. Don't forget to tell all your friends about us. Set us up on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, as well as YouTube. This has been Baked Under the Wing of Juice Sauce. Um, and again, me and Bad Cop picked the middle one. Bigger Cop, he picked the first one. Um, 
But to be fair, all three are nice. The same as the you know the other range that we've done mm. by them. If you want to check them out, which is called the, the Jam Vape Co. Um, but there's it's nice to have ones that stand out to you. And to me, the middle one stood out to me and, and Bangkok, and obviously the first one, which was called Toasted, stood out to you. Mm. And being that it didn't really have that toasted feel, did it? No, it was it's more, more of like a confetti cake yeah. sort of going on. It was nice. I mean, to be honest, through. quite happily vape these two all day long. Yeah, definitely, definitely, and the same with the first range that mm. we did. You know, the first two yeah. that we did, the, the marmalade and the, you know, and the strawberry jam. Yeah. They were, you know, but getting back to these ones, I, I, I think the middle one was really, you know, proper nice. It was, it was one of them that pulls me back in, and but that's just my personal opinion, to be fair. But um, yeah, I like it. I thought it was nice. Yeah, mm. a good range. Right, catch us back next time on Spitting Tripper Reviews.